Things, places, friends, places, years and moments half forgotten, laughs, fears, songs, tears. Memories are made of this. I remember a time when a dream proved itself, alas, nothing but a dream. The League of Nations, its aims and ideals the finest, but lasting peace can only be made if all men desire it. And in 1937, well, it was all a matter of one's sense of value. bugles and rattles at the barracks, the fake procession so that the horses could get used to the noise and the cheering, for horses too must learn a sense of values, especially for a coronation. Once again was a closely guarded treasure to be temporarily removed from the Tower of London, for once again a sense of values called for it to be placed upon a head. Not upon the head of the first intended, for he had sacrificed his claim because of another. For Edward now, not the throne of England, but the title of Duke of Windsor. In his stead, one who had never aspired, yet who was now to devote his life, for such was his sense of values. But whoever is destined, the tradition goes on. A coronation is not so much a matter of the individual as the occasion. Yes, an occasion that doesn't come round very often. So when it does, you make the most of it. And how much a part you make of it depends entirely upon, well, your sense of value. So Britain made ready, while among the rising stands of Westminster, her statesmen attended to their business, and there was plenty for them to attend to. For the world outside Britain's coronation of 1937 was restless, ever-changing, ominous and full of doubts and fears. Yes, everywhere you cared to look, except perhaps in one direction, namely westwards. In the United States, a president had been re-elected. In taking again the oath of office as president of the United States, I assume the solemn obligation of leading the American people forward along the road over which they have chosen to advance. But the road on which America had chosen to advance wasn't that chosen by certain others, for their sense of values wasn't the same at all. On the bridge of a battleship in the Mediterranean, the leader of all the Germans being entertained by the leader of all the Italians, and we don't mean the king of it. Yes, the boys were all there together, inspecting the Italian fleet and estimating its fighting power should there be, well, trouble. Of course, who was going to make the trouble was anybody's guess, depending, of course, on their sense of values. <laughs> 